Hello, I'm Valder Beebe. I'm the host and a visionary of the Valder Beebe Show's That Celebrity Interview. Good day, Eric Davis. Thank you for joining me here in Dallas, Texas. How are you today? I'm doing great. How are you? I'm fine. We're going to talk about one of my favorite things. I told you guys I would have Eric Davis of Bang Dango here, and he's going to get us the inside scoop on the summer hottest blockbusters. Okay, tell me it's not summer already. Well, yeah, we are at summer already. <laughs> summer, summer keeps backing up, and now it begins at the end of April, on April 27th with Avengers Infinity War, the big Marvel Studios movie. I'm, so, I'm wearing the shirt from Fan Shop of Thanos, who's the villain in the film, the culmination of all, over a dozen Marvel movies, Avengers, Guardians of the Galaxy, Spider-Man, Black Panther. So that's going to be, I think it's one of the biggest films of the decade that's going to kick off this summer that's just full of awesome movies. Okay, I, let me ask you this. You may not be able to answer, but it's going to kick off the summer. But you know, I just heard that Black Panther made a billion dollars. Will it be like that? I think it's going to definitely be on par with Black Panther. And just and Black Panther is just a, such a great, a great story, you know, a pop culture phenomenon. And I think one of the cool things about Avengers Infinity War, if you, if you just saw Black Panther, well, there's multiple characters from Black Panther that are going to be in Avengers Infinity War. There's a huge action sequence that takes place on Wakanda. And so you can kind of roll right from Black Panther into Infinity War. You get those characters you, with the Guardians, with the Avengers, with Spider-Man, with the Hulk. With, you know, everybody's in this film. And I think it just looks so great and so massive. And unlike any superhero movie that we've really ever seen before, uh, just a built-up anticipation over the past 10 years. And so, yeah... I think it's going to definitely be on par with Black Panther for sure. Okay, what else can we look forward to? I think we got a Star Wars movie coming. We do. We have a Han Solo movie. It's like a Han Solo prequel. If you've ever wanted to know, hey, how did Han Solo meet Chewbacca? How did he win the Millennium Falcon in a card game against Lando Calrissian? Well, this movie is going to show us. We get a young Lando played by Donald Glover, who's great. Uh, we have Alden Onright plays the young Han Solo. We have Amelia Clark from Game of Thrones who's in it. Woody Harrelson is in this film. And it just looks like a big, fun, swashbuckling adventure to sort of take us into Memorial Day where some people start their summer, depending on where you start your summer. If you're a movie fan, you're starting your summer in April now. Uh, but a lot of people will look forward to that on Memorial Day. And then after that, a Jurassic Park movie, a Mission Impossible movie, a new Ocean's Eight spin-off movie from the Ocean's Eleven films, a Pixar's Incredibles 2, Mamma Mia movie. Just so much coming out this summer. No matter what kind of movie fan you are, I think you're going to find something that, that you're going to love. You know, Eric, I have a lot of people that come on and say they love their job on the Valder BB show. I get a feeling you love your job. I watch a lot of movies, and I love movies, so it's okay. <laughs> It's a great job to have to really give people the inside scoop. All right, so we start on April the 27th. We'll start with the biggest movie out there, the Avengers movie. So we're all ready. Anything else we need to know? You know, I think that there's, if you're looking to kind of get away from and see a different kind of superhero movie, there's Deadpool 2 which is an uh, R-rated, irreverent kind of uh, film. It, it's, it's a little spicier and a little bit raunchier, and it's super funny if you know the first Deadpool movie. And what's really cool is that we teamed up with the creator of Deadpool on a poster that you can get when you buy tickets for Deadpool 2 at Fandango. So that's really fun. If you're a fan of Deadpool, you could have this really cool poster to go along with it. We also have this really fun VIP Plus program where you buy four movie tickets, you get some money back and you could use that for another movie ticket or you could use it to go rent a movie at Fandango now or get a cool t-shirt like I have on right now at Fandango Fan Shop. So that's a really fun little incentive for moviegoers as well uh, as we go throughout the summer. Just you get a little bit back that you can, uh, you know, use to watch some other movies. You've answered all my Facebook questions. I don't have any questions because you've done it. You did a good job, Eric Davis. So I want to thank you for giving us the inside scoop. I'm ready for summer. Thanks so, so much. <laughs>